hello friends uh, welcome again and this is my new project new management system and i have developed this project in spring boot react and mysql right so spring boot version i am using is spring boot 2.1.6 release mysql version is 5.6 for id i am using sts spring boot tool suits for developing the spring boot application developing the api and visual studio code for writing the reactjs applications and for mysql i am using the php my admin which is integrated with the jam server for port i am running the spring boot application on port 8080 and uh, uh, react application on port 3000 right so these all technology stacks and the uh, id and the port i am using for developing this project new management system so let's start with the feature and uh, functionality is what the function uh, functions available inside this project right so the project title is live management system and it's a major project which has two types of role right that is the admin and the user so admin can now perform certain operations and user can perform certain operations right so normally this application we have developed for managing the lives only not for other things right so we have major project with the leave payroll uh, and the employee administration that is employee management system you can watch it on our website or youtube channel you will get the features there right so once you run this project you will get this home page you can see this is the home page and this is the static home page there is nothing dynamic on it right so this one is a static right? this is about and this is also a static page right this is admin login from here admin can log in and admin can perform certain operations this is a user login and from here user can log in and user can perform certain operations this is a feedback and this is a website feedback any user can submit it and after that it will be visible to the admin right so let's start with the admin login first so the user id is admin at the rate admin.com and the password is test right yeah. yes this is the leave management system and uh, you can see this is the home about i already explained this home about right and the dashboard is this this is employee administration from here you can see the all of the employee which you have added right from the front end application that is the react and if you want to edit any part just click on the edit and that will be that will open the things into the edit and after that you can update it right if you want to delete any record just click on delete and it will ask for the confirmation of deletion right if you click on the yes then it will be deleted from the database if you want add new employee just click on add new employee and this add new employee page will be open and you can uh, fill the form and after that you can submit it those details will be saved inside the database right this is a, a next one is a leave administration all of the leaves and uh, i think uh, there is some issue yeah let me check so this is the leave report right you can see uh, there are different types of color available for the status means approved will be green this approved will be red and pending will be orange right so this is a leave report right so from here you will be able to see this admin will be able to see the leave report and this is a feedback report from here uh, all of the feedback which has been submitted by different users will be displayed with the star writing right okay if you want to see the details just click on that uh, arrow icon and you will be able to see the details right this is add new leave from here and uh, add can, you can add the leave right so here from from here you can select the uh, leave so user and the leave is status and the reason for the leave from day to day total number of days and descriptions and after that uh, if you submit it then it will be saved inside the database and you can see the report from here like a leave report right the last option is logout if you click on the logout then all of the session will be destroyed and you will not be able to see the internal pages like uh, add leave add employee like that like let me show you you can see the uh, menus has been destroyed right so so if you want to log in again if you want to log in then you can log in and you will be able to add the employees and manage the system right so now i am logging as a user so user id is user at the rate user.com the password is test right so this is the user right here you can see this is the apply review this is the my leave report and the my account so apply leave so you can see uh, user can apply for his leave only right so there is leave status and user 
is not displaying because it's the user, right? Because this form is also session driven, right? We have managed the components according to the uh, user session, right? So this is the apply view and this is the my live reports, right? You can see this is the my live report and both are pending, right? If you want to edit it, you can edit and update it, right? And you can delete that both lives also. This is a my account section. From here, you can see my account section and you can update your account section also, right? So a uh, user can apply the lives, my lives and my account. User can see that, right? And the logout. If I click on the logout, then all of the session will be destroyed and you will not be able to log in uh, and access the internal pages, right? So these are all features we had to look inside this project, right? So the project title is human system, as I told you earlier, this is a Java Spring Boot and React based application. So if you need any enhancement, any more features inside this project, just put it into the comments. We will incorporate those changes. We will make this project more better and better according to our requirements. And don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos and the latest technologies. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.